Hello, Internet friends. My name is Bay. This is Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, but I'm bad. A light commentary playthrough where I don't talk as much as I normally do in previous playthroughs like Dark Souls and Bloodborne and stuff like that. But if you want to go watch those, you can. And of course, if you want to watch this one, you can right now. We are in Shinra Manor. I have a couple things to craft first off. Just a couple things to get going here. Didn't realize I can already chew through some giga potions. And then we've got the next bracer, maybe. A little bit of a side grade upgrade coming in here. And because we keep being solo as Kate Sith right now, might as well upgrade his. That's all the materials we got. We can make this expeditionary metal. I wonder when this will come into play. Maybe late game builds. Starting with level one, doing one synergy to go to two. Well, two levels of limit break means you're at level three because you're always at level one. So you start at level two and then you go to level three. These are spirit, right? They still take the same. Oh, it adds a material. Same stuff changes the craftable then adds a material. Those leaves. All right. So let's see, where are we going here? In potion drunk real quick. That's already sorted. That's when the guy popped out. We're going this way. I can't use the other elevator for whatever reason. stuck. Oh, what is this? Oh, no. A crate throwing mini game. Yep, this is not going great. Timing is crazy. Pick up the Google is glitching through the box. wasn't a good item that I would get. It takes so long to wind up, load the crate, aim the crate, throw the crate, crate physics. Give you what, 90 seconds and it takes 10 seconds to throw one crate? It's unfortunate.
Something behind here. Thirty six, ten, fifty nine, ninety seven. Thirty six, ten, fifty nine, ninety seven. At least, hopefully, that's a seven, and the first one is a one. Thirty six, ten, fifty nine, ninety seven. Okay. I don't know what that's used for. Yet. Almost cap on Phoenix Downs. <laughs> Guess I could check. I think no one really has. Yeah, everyone's at like the point where they need like 20s and 25 for the next really good stuff. than anticipated and I concluded that rather than allow you to run amok any longer I ought to help you see yourselves out peacefully the password is comprised of four two-digit numbers I wrote them down in this very room but <laughs> where well then no time to waste <laughs> Oh, that's really the only... Oh, that's cool. You actually have to rotate it like you're rotating a, um, a turning lock. Like, I'm assuming it's the same order that's on the wall and not some weird... Amalgamation. Oh, better late than never, I suppose. Come in. Obvious encounter room is obvious. And so, a 
I'm afraid you'll have to dispose of it. Rawr. Try not to die. The forgotten specimen. Everything. Why put gravity in the game if everything is immune to it? Or petrify. You use it on regular mobs, but like. Got my 
back. We gotta get through this. Go on. <sighs> That'll do. What? Huh? Wish it hadn't come to this. There's a wee round of applause! <laughs> 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 Keep going, huh? Just a little should help. Stop it. Yep. This is super frustrating. Okay. Seems to have a uh, soft and rage. Gotta heal first. Wasn't he built for this kind of thing? Excellent work dispatching that scene. 
Thanks to you, the manor is a little more neat and tidy. All well-earned praise aside, since that meddlesome test subject is finally out of my hair, I have no further reason to remain here. <laughs> it's been nothing if not entertaining. Until we meet again, exterminators. That smug asshole. Next time I see him, I'm ramming my fist right through his face. Agreed? Agreed. <laughs> we best get going. The terminal's waiting. So well, what does that mean? If you... Is it not just like a wipe game over screen here? If you actually failed? Do you get captured and then get to come here as the other team? Hmm. Also, I'm realizing Aerith needs a spammable spell. As currently, she does not have one. It's never come up till now, but I probably should give her one. I thought she had something, but I must have moved it. Sidetracked. Well, we can but try again. No sense tune on past mistakes. Uh, right. Hmm. That leaves one empty spot in your party. More threats may be lurking within, so choose your comrade wisely. Oh, you only get to choose one person for this section? Yeah, it says party selection locked, but then... Cannot currently change party, yet I just changed the party. Oh, I guess these two can't be changed. material on that one.
I don't know what that means. So that Kate Sith and the others escaped Hojo. So if you fail that, what happened? I mean, you're not going to lose those three people for the rest of your playthrough, although that would be insane. I'm assuming that you have to, it would cut back over to Cloud and them, and you have to then go rescue them, and they have to fight the boss? Maybe? Hmm. I, I don't know. time. Yes. Pardon me. The core's a bit grim, no? Doesn't matter. Who are you? Vincent Valentine. I'm. Security. <laughs> uh. Why are you here? Be brief. Your terminal. Mm hmm. Card. Hmm? <laughs> sure. There. Oh. You have the authorization in beast. Oh, great. <laughs> Though you're clearly not Murasaki. Explain yourself. Ah, uh, it's a bit of a long story, and we'd love to tell you all about it, but there's something we really need to look up first. Can't go letting our foe win the information war, eh? Your foe? And who might that be? man who many people, myself included, once called a hero, Sephiroth. He's insane, and he's after something so powerful, it could destroy the planet unless we stop him. I see. Then I have one more sin to atone for. unlocked use it as you see fit mr. Murasaki don't mind if we do I guess <laughs> that's the only bit of Vincent we get 
No way. He's not actually a vampire, though. He just chooses to be. Well, this version is far older than the originals. Must have been in his 50s now. He's a old ex-soldier, if I'm remembering correctly. <laughs> like how Kate Seth immediately realizes he's not like an actual thread, just hops up on his shoulder. There is unconfirmed speculation via some interviews that the, uh, the director or the head producer, one of the two, for Rebirth, would like to have Sid and Vincent playable, but probably not until the final chapter of this trilogy. However, that does not rule out a Sid slash Vincent DLC, either two small DLCs with each of them or one with both just split just like you had with uh, Yuffie because Yuffie's DLC is only like six hours long like Vincent's backstory would be a cool DLC and then probably Sid before Tiny Bronco maybe I don't know let's wait and find out we're not gonna get any DLC of this game for probably you know, eight months to a year If there even is DLC. Unconfirmed. There she is! Cloud, my boy! Still got that key card? Boy, me cloud. Gonna need a bit of time with this. Might I suggest a spot of recon? Oh, this is the library. <laughs> oh. Get out of here. Oh no. I don't recall giving you permission to go in there. Mm. Oh, it was an honest mistake. We didn't mean any. Ah! 
Don't hunt me, please. I can explain. Drop him. Why should I? He's trespassing, like you. Save it. I've had a pretty shit day. What a coincidence. So have I. Hmm. Stops moving. Did I need that? Let's do this. Oh, no! Here we go with me. Okay. forever. Okay, so that has to be hit with, with magic, I guess. Someone looks kind of shaky. I'm trying to figure out how to build any FB. Not 
build an ATV, rather, sorry. Yeah, I just don't know how to build ATV on this guy. I can't hit him. Every time I go to hit him, I get hit and I get interrupted. It's crazy. Everything hits me. It's crazy. Let's switch it up. Face down. Let's go. Dude, holy crap. What's this? This is new. Hmm. Backline. Yeah. 
I don't I don't see anywhere. Oh, well, then it's a different button. Hmm. really helps me very much right now. Okay, up there has to be a way. Stay out of his way. Hey! Not looking good. I just This fight's gonna be a nightmare in hard mode. ATB on him. You'll feel better in a second. Anytime. Busy? That'll do. So much no. help. Easily the hardest fight I've done in the entire game so far at this point. Like there's no not even a question. This is the the game is pivoting quite severely here. Be careful. I'd never have ATB to pressure him. on this man. Bury him so much damage. I don't I can't build ATB, so I can't keep him debuffed. Allow me. Shit. Damn it. Here goes. Okay. That'll do. Good grief. I won't let anyone hurt you. Thank 
Thanks for coming to help. Oh, I know. It's supposed to be hard. It's just the game didn't. Like, this is a totally new system and a totally different type of encounter that the game never had before it. So it's just, it's just very jarring. And this is like a Bloodborne boss level of aggro. It's crazy. story. Vincent Valentine, former Turk. Stumbled on your file in the company database. There's a reason you're alone in the dark down here, and that reason has something to do with Sephiroth. Am I right? That's none of your business. I only ask because you might want to come with us. I don't know whether Sephiroth hmm. is dead or alive or something in between. But I do know that if I stick with this lot, I'll find out one way or another. Is this how you want your story to end? your way out then now we know where the temple is let's not bother the man <laughs> hey space cadet come on so there's nothing else in this room did I miss going into the other room? Yep, guess so. Maybe you can only go into one of the rooms? I didn't go into the library. Just things to check on uh, New Game Plus, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, that was wild. Like, obviously, Vincent's ridiculous. The issue is, like, nothing has been that difficult with that aggressive of a boss. Also a boss that is the two times you put to pressure him, you need to hit him when he's doing the seething walk, but then he counters you. So you have to use magic. So it's also party makeup because you're forced to do Cloud Kate Sith who are more or less both melees. Just thought it was so much damage. I wish I, I don't know. Trying to use synergy abilities to build ATB faster was also not working because I obviously take longer to do. It was just a, a, a vast, sudden step up in aggression and no time to build actions. Just a very sudden difficulty spike. I think Yuffie would have been better there, so I could have used her to heal with items, which I can't do in hard mode, so. I don't think there's any way that he would remove our buff, so maybe just taking time and putting protect on people. 
Hmm. Shell would have been better. I think more of his damage was magic. Chaos magic. Then there might be top secret material hidden somewhere in here? Is <sighs> that all you ever think about? <sighs> well, excuse me for trying to be helpful. <sighs> Quite the cameo, though. For now, anyway. Still a fantastic character. I wonder what they're gonna do if they're gonna do DLC or uh, just wait until the third game. Whew. All right. Well, now I know the game is at that level. I'll have to figure out some. Uh, How do you build ATB on bosses that don't let you hit them very often? Okay, next stop, the temple. Hear that black materia? I'm coming for you. <laughs> oh man, my rep's gonna go through the roof. Well, it ain't like it could go down. <clears throat> oh. oh, it's on. So, <laughs> where is it? Hi. About that. What's the matter? You ain't been bluffing this whole time. Have you? No, that's not it. We could go there right now, if you really wanted. Hmm? But before that, would you mind a quick trip to the saucer? Hmm. What? Why would we want to go there? To even set foot inside the temple, we'll need to get our hands on a relic called the Keystone. Trouble is, it's been missing for nigh on 20 years. So, any guesses as to where it was last seen? The gold saucer. I know, it's a stretch, no denying that, <laughs> but it's the only lead I've got. Then let's follow it. We trust you. You do? Thank you. <laughs> uh, thank you. <sighs> thank you. Well, if we gotta, once we're good, let's get a move on. Right. Right. Yeah, that's going to be quite a boss fight on hard mode. Keeping him debuffed, I imagine, would be super helpful. What's this? in his arm. Our long-awaited reunion. I'm not going with you, so back off. <laughs> you misunderstand. I'm defying my boss to be here. 
Cause I've got a hunger that cannot be denied. My desire to see you has driven me on. That's what I get for redlining the old engine. All right, my friend, it's the final lap. So let's cut it one last time! He's mine! Mm, we'll be one. Get ready. kind of powers before. Gotta see what he could do. Yep. You okay? Uh, 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 I won't have your pity. This is a race, remember? Come on, Cloud. We're on the home stretch. How the ranges. No holding back. Camera? Can steal an elixir from him. <laughs> Interesting. Here we go. to you don't worry yeah she's right 
You're gonna be just fine. Come on. The gilded saucer awaits. <laughs> and the keystone. Yeah. Supporters of the Shinra Resistance Committee. My name is Glenn Lodbrock, a representative of Wu Tai's interim government. The hour is upon us when we must rise up to confront tyranny. Mere days ago, Junon's cannon rang out. A message. A declaration by Shinra's new president that he, like his father before him, would rule by fear. What's more, we recently learned that he had sanctioned the development of living weapons grown within the Mako reactors that provide power to your homes. Alarmed, we decided to seek answers. And in accordance with the Cease Fire Treaty, our government sent officials to investigate. Shinra promised their full cooperation. But when our inspectors duly arrived, they were mercilessly slaughtered. The footage you are about to see was taken from inside one of the reactors. what Rufus Shinra called the ceasefire. Friends, we do not have our enemy's military might. Nevertheless, a righteous fury burns in each of our hearts. A fire that we may carry to Midgar. And there, together, Put the city of Mako and Misery to the torch! This is our answer, Rufus Shinra. We are ready to march. And to lead us. Wu Tai's commander, Viceroy Saru. Who exactly is this Saruf? The Invisible Man? Regrettably, we have no intelligence to present at this time. <laughs> then you clearly aren't looking hard enough. Look harder. Ma'am. <laughs> what about that Glenn... what's his name? Glenn Ladbrock, ma'am. Ex-soldier, P-0 class, a prototype. Fifteen years ago, he was sent to Rador on a geological survey, which ended in failure and led to his defection. <laughs> a spineless deserter nursing a grudge, then. Subsequently, Lodbrok took to the road, seeking to forge connections with others who shared his anti-Shinra sentiments. <laughs> if you mean avalanche, they're dead and buried. I'm afraid I do not, sir. The fall of the Republic triggered a spate of uprisings in the surrounding regions. We suspect the SRC is largely comprised of forces who were defeated during the unrest. Well, who could blame them? They fought against the Republic in the name of freedom. But when the smoke finally cleared, they found themselves under the heel of a new oppressor. Why, I'd be more surprised if they didn't hate us. Hmm. 
Pity about Saruf. Would be good to put a face to the name. The Ancient is en route to the temple as we speak. Pursuing her is our top priority. She will guide us to the promised land. One way or another. Hmm. Mm. Regarding the speech, sir, many will interpret it as a declaration of war. And given that it was a worldwide broadcast, it would be prudent to issue a response. I intend to make a statement. Sung, if you would. Sir. So, how exactly are we supposed to get back to the salsa? With all the mountains and valleys in between, definitely not on foot. It's just way too far. Thoughts, Kixef? Hey, cat! Thoughts? Huh? Um, well, you see. <laughs> Look, smoke. Maybe someone's trying to call for Sid? If so, let's hitch a ride. Whew. Breaking news at this hour. Cloud, I'm picking up proto relic energy signals from a group of robed individuals. You are? Indeed, though I'm unable to ascertain why. So, check it out? How very astute of you. While they're not in any obvious hurry, they do appear to be heading toward a specific location. Should you find the time, I ask that you track their movements. See where it is they're going. Breaking news at this hour. In response to last night's illegal broadcast by the S. President Rufus Shinra held an emergency press conference this morning. In it, the president denounced the SRC's claims as baseless propaganda and dismissed their alleged Mako reactor footage as a digital fabrication. The company has launched an investigation into the individual who delivered the address, as well as the nature of the organization he claims to represent. Breaking news at this hour. In response to last night's mm. illegal broadcast by the SRC, President... My dog little cat, I feed from time to time, hasn't come around for a while and it's making me sick with worry. You've got a great voice. <laughs> oh, you flatter me. I didn't even know I was doing it. You see, this cat I feed sometimes has gone missing. And when I worry, I cannot help but see. Hey. Hmm? Sounds like a job for a merc, doesn't it? What? 
Well, aren't you the picture of confidence? You wouldn't happen to be a professional feline finder, would you? Not officially, but I've got a good cat catching record. <laughs> Been doing it since I was a kid. <laughs> I'm Christine, by the way, chef and chanteuse. You might want to start by looking around the foot of Mount Nebel. She's got the most beautiful snow white coat. Hmm. Petite little thing, too. Speaking of, she must be starving out there. Here, be sure to feed her. Be a dear and find my darling cat! <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. All this talk of cats makes me think of Fluffy. Yeah, the one and only. What happened to her, anyway? No idea. Well, Haven't seen her since the fire five years ago. Yeah. Right? I can't shake the feeling that I just left her to die. I really hope she's okay, but if she's not. Hmm. One more enemy to battle against. Ah, so going the other way now, the original way. Okay. I gotta see what the proto relic in this zone's all about, though. Do that one first. Chagley. That's the plan. At least till they get to wherever they're going. <laughs> Getting sleepy, are we? With how slow they walk, who wouldn't? Can run on ahead and play scout. But stay where we can see you. <sighs> Ever since we left the Vale, never should have dropped the intellectual shtick. <laughs> Have Wait. to give them a nudge or not? Can no. these guys do anything? Uh, Maybe? I doubt they're lucid enough to even know what they're doing. Probably better that way. Sad, but true. 
I'll bet they've seen some things. Reduced to their instincts. Like animals. Man. Screw Shinra. Damn right. <laughs> And we're going inside this building, right? I'm not gonna lie, you preferred the gruff Nanaki, but the range of the actor is kind of amazing, though. That's a good job. It's not just as simple as as putting on a voice, right? It's What's that? Making two characters. Extractions effects on the region's water supply. And? And they found that there were none. Or so the official statement claimed. Oh, no need to worry then. If I may put your minds at ease, both Nibelheim's water tower and pipe network utilized filtration devices that were state of the art for the time. Furthermore, there was no evidence that water quality was impacted by the reactor. The filters likely mitigated any deleterious effects. Well, I grew up drinking that water. That certainly explains a lot. Sure those filters worked? You tell me. Hmm. On you. So it's your turn. Let me handle this. One more time. Is that it? Quite annoying, hmm? <laughs> Part of one, looks like. Akeem must have ingested the fragment by mistake. 
Little wonder I was unable to locate it. I suspect other creatures are in possession of the remainder. So what now? Hmm. Oh. Your hooded friends may well lead us to other fragments. Whoa there! Should be marked like cattle. No one. <laughs> For real. <laughs> wow. I've located another group not far from your location. I ask that you accompany them to their objective. They may lead us to yet another fragment. The Yuffie Nanaki friendship that just exists is very wholesome uh, I think we got fans they're after the proto relic too ignore them Who are we ignoring? Let the robed boys? Well, I think that'll do it for this chunk. If you've been watching along live, hope you've been enjoying it. Got a little frustrated earlier because the game just took the difficulty knob from seven to nine and a half to ten immediately was just very startling considering I had not uh, had a fight that difficult since but we will continue moving forward if you're watching on YouTube of course don't forget there's Final Fantasy 16 and 7 remake and Dark Souls 1 2 and 3 and Bloodborne and both God of War games and both Jedi games and uh, just huge playlist of RPGs if you would like over on the channel but until then I'll Catch you in the next one. No. Oh.